Hey guys, welcome back to Mafia Definitive Edition. I'm gonna just go ahead and put it out there. I have a really strong feeling that in this episode, shit's about to go down. I'm just saying, all right? So on the last episode, we took out two of the main antagonists, one being Galetti. I think it was Galetti. Galetti, Galetti. I'm, I'm really bad with names. If you've been around the channel for a while, you should know. But in addition to that, we took out Don Morello's brother, okay? Sergio Morello, which is... Uh, like his top top guy obviously i have a feeling that in this episode if not the next one we're gonna go ahead and possibly take out the you know don morello the main dude the only thing is that we have like five chapters left in this game so i don't know what happens there like what happens after that creme de la creme after we killed sergio it was chaos for weeks our guys against their guys and morello gone to ground but a boss can't stay hidden forever. For a Don to be feared, he's got to be seen. Finally, Damn. came through that he was gonna break cover. Dude, I... Morello wants to thumb his nose at us. Taking a show like there's not a war on, we'll meet him in the streets. We do him like this. We wait outside the theater till the end of the show. All those rich assholes will start coming out. That's when we hit Morello and his gorillas in a crowd before they see us coming. The theater is going to be packed and not just with seps. There's a good chance the mayor, maybe even the chief might be there too. That's the goddamn point, Tom. We kill Morello in public in front of the city's creme de la creme. Then they'll all know who's in charge. And it doesn't matter if you have a badge or a gavel or a fat wad of cash in your pocket. If you cross Salgari and his boys, you're dead. Okay, boss, <laughs> we'll get it done. Take the machine guns. Make sure you don't draw attention to yourselves hanging around outside the theater. You keep the choppers hidden until you spot Morello. And then you light them up. I want it to look like that white suit is covered in roses. You got it? Sure, boss. I love this camaraderie, man. Like, this brotherhood. I fucking love it, dude. Holy smokes. About to get in this there. and it. We're finally doing this. Keep your head. We got to get to the theater before the show's over. Tom, you're driving. Got to be honest. I didn't think that... word, boys. Morello dies tonight. Tonight? Shit. Good luck, guys. I didn't think we were going to kill him off like that. I thought he was going to kill a lot of our men before... I mean, who knows? Maybe somebody dies. I don't know. I don't know how long theater plays go on for, but... Getting late. What's Put your foot down, Tom. Can't believe after all these years we're finally going after Morello. Not his crew, not his family. Finally putting him in the ground. We're putting a lot of history to rest. What happens when he's gone? We'll be kings. Nah, I mean, what happens with the Don? You think he'll be all tore up? I think he'll start wearing a nice white suit. <laughs> the thing is, what happens after this? Like, if, if we kill him now, and he's obviously, you know, the top of the top, as far as antagonists, what right? happens after? Yeah, just sweating bullets. You look how I feel. Nearly there. Let's keep it together. That must mean that there's well, probably... Go for Morello. No one else. Once he's down, these guys will panic. We're actually doing this. He's been up against the boss for what, 10 years? More. You think that white suit would make him an easier target? That means that that might there there might be somebody else after him. I mean, oh dude, I'm so like I'm so so intrigued. What the heck is about to go down here? What's about to go down? Obviously, I know what's about to go down. A damn freaking a gang to shoot out. Really, dude? After him! Chase him down, Tom! Oh! The Don will hang us out to dry! When I get close, shoot for the cars protecting it. Let's get him out of the picture. You got it! Oh, Lord. Epic chase. Bunch of them were staked out around the theater. Last time they get paid off by Morello, tomorrow they're ours. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's crazy, dog. Nah, their their motors is getting trashed right here. That's right, Tom. Woo! Oh, 
Elvis! Dance! Guys are out of force! Take him out if you can. But Morello's the price tonight. Gangs is coming through, baby! Get out the way! Believe it or not, you start getting used to the whole shooting mechanic in this game. You're still an ice cold wheel, man, aren't ya? Like the whole you gotta shoot and then wait for the If we lose him, we'll go to ground for months. More maybe. Don't let him give us a slip. He could be headed anywhere. You gotta wait for the reticle to go back down. He might even move out of state for a while. We need to whack him tonight. I don't know. I, I don't want to interrupt too much of the dialogue, but I, I like the way the aiming system works in this game. After a little while, you get used to it. The recoil pattern, recoil system, I guess you can call it. Oh my god, more? We work our way through his guys, then we come for him. Oh, believe that, sucker. I don't think we're allowed to uh, take him down right now because it's not even letting me shoot his car at this point in time. And we're, we're relatively close to him, anyways. He's trying to shake us off in the back streets. I know this city better than anyone. Don't worry. <laughs> for the right man for the job. This is gonna be a squeeze. Morello's gotten himself a good driver, but he doesn't match you, Tom. <laughs> That's right, baby. I'm the whole package. Gangster killer, father, husband, and a freaking cab driver. <laughs> Get out of here, suckers. When they're close, you can just spam it. Now they're not that close. They're getting away. There we go. Now when they're very close, you, you, you're, you're allowed to spam it a little bit. These guys don't give up. Neither do we. We're taking this all the way. I love this brotherhood, man. Polly and Sam, bro. I'll, I'll never forget these characters. I swear. Just like Vito and Joe. Freaking love it. legendary right here this is a fucking legendary game right here come on punk you like that sucker oh this dude's got a shotgun a full freaking fled shotgun Ooh, hold on. Where's the med kit? Let me take this real quick. Don't mind if I do. What are you doing? You think you're gonna shoot my boys? This is a brotherhood we got going on. <laughs> I got him on top. The water tower gone. Holy smokes. Time for the Tommy gun. Tommy pulled out the Tommy gun. That's 
right, bitch. Sorry. For the vulgar language. Ooh. Lucio Marcano. Sexy pose you got there, brother. I got the storm. Oh, I'm on to you, <laughs> all right. <laughs> I'm on to you like glue, baby. Damn, I just blew up his fucking car. <laughs> nah, not today, son. Not today. Oh, there's something here. What is this? Oh, he's taking the plane. <gasps> Into that car! Tommy, up front. You're the best shot out of all of us. Really? I thought I was the best driver. I'm the best shot too. Damn, I guess I am the best. I am the full Get package the indeed. Car. Get us into the air. We don't have the speed. Take us up! Yo, this is that big follow. We see where it lands. We rush in all guns blazing and we wow. You drive like this in your old job. So what was I saying? Oh, right. Okay, here's what's happening. We follow it. We see where it lands. We rush in all guns blazing and we finish them off. No way that bird's staying in the sky. That thing's not gonna land. It's gonna crash. It look I aeronautic to you. <laughs> Thank Christ we got you in the car, Professor. Morello's not gonna walk away from a plane crash. That's a maybe, but he ain't dead till we've seen him dead. Out of all of us, you two should know that by now. Oh, snap. With you today, Tom? Sorry, man, I'm, I'm nervous, bro. Where's he trying to take it? Maybe out near the racetrack. More chance of landing it safe outside the city. He'll land, maybe, but it's not gonna be safe. Wherever he comes down, we'll be there soon after. No problem. We got this, man. Just gotta get there. Is it gonna go? Yep. Yeah. It's going. But we don't have time to relax. We gotta be sure he's dead before the cops show. No one's gonna survive that. Yo, what if we get there and somebody smoke. dies? I can't believe we did this. I know. It don't seem real. Stay alert with your guns close. We've come too far to get lazy at the end. We don't have long. 50 seconds. The cop in the city is going to be on his way. We get out, we check the wreckage, we leave. Got it? Yo. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> wow. Are you drive like this in your old job. <laughs> That's not the proper entrance I wanted to do, but they should have. Oh. Jesus Christ. Bastard's daddy doesn't even know it yet. He knows it now. Whoa. Yeah, pal. 
That'll do it. Come on. Let's make tracks. <laughs> Bro, he's laid the whole fucking mag on him. them huh see you on the other side Marku wow dude that's incredible that was incredible that was incredible. You fucking phantom. I've been chasing you for three goddamn years. You do life for this, Tom. Maybe you in the chair. You don't want the guy who was punching tickets. You want the guy who was handing them out. So that's what this has been all about, huh? You offering up Salieri. The Don's books. The ones Frank stole. I have them. They're enough to put Salieri away forever and they're yours. Assuming we have a deal. My family. For the Don. Yo, what the fuck? Oh, that's so fucked up. You recognize anyone? Look again. Old man, that's Don Papone, two younger lads of Morello and Salieri. Yeah. Okay, I see it. It must be what? 1920? April. Morello's wedding. Celieri was the best man. <laughs> Jesus. They're just kids. Now they're Eddie's soldiers in Papone's mob. <laughs> so what happened? How did they go from being best mates to Morello on a slab? I don't know. I didn't even know they were friends. You don't know could fill up the fucking Chrysler building. In 22, Papone drowns up at the lake. Right? In order to keep things running smoothly, Salieri and Morello agreed to divvy up the city. Yeah, I heard the story, so what? Well, their friendship should have made the deal work, but didn't make a lick of difference. After Morello. Celieri was beaming, thinking we ran the whole damn town. Me, I was just happy the war was over. But then I got to thinking about something. What good? It was all of Morello's money if it couldn't protect him from a regular Joe like me. Cabby, for Christ's sake. It only got him one thing. A great big bullseye in his fucking forehead. And that thought, it just kept turning round and round in my head until one day, I'm looking in a mirror. I start seeing a bullseye too. Right here. Dry your tears in the water hundreds, do you? I wasn't about to give up the good life, I know that. I just told myself that I was smarter than Morello. That I wouldn't turn around one day and find Polly or Sam pointing a gun at my head. The thing is, you don't see it when you're out on the street, scrapping, fighting for your life. And the guy next to you isn't just your partner, he's your brother. You'd stick a knife in someone for your brother, right? But at night, 
You lie awake, wondering what he and Adam were whispering about behind the bar. Wondering if your best friend is hungry enough to betray you. Election campaign. Wow. Any trouble? This is crazy. No bus, no trouble at all. Got something else for me? All these feels a little light. There's a little extra in mind to cover the difference. You ever go swimming, Tom? Been to the shore a few times, sure. I knew a couple of guys once. Took some dames out to the lake. Had a few beers, a few laughs. Then one of them decides to go in the water. Gets to the center of the lake and realizes he's running out of steam. Can't make it back in. He starts shouting for help. Now the other guy, he's a strong swimmer. He goes out in the lake to drag his buddy back to shore. Problem is, the first guy, the one too stupid to know when the water's too deep for him, he panics. Grabs his friend by the neck and they both go under and don't come up again. Paulie's your friend. And I know you're loyal to him. And I respect that. But don't you ever pay his tab again. Okay, boss. Good. Now, we gotta talk about this Turnbull. The guy running for governor? The same. He's been flapping his gums a lot about cracking down on our businesses. That's rich. He spent more on whores than Paulie and Sam combined. <laughs> you want me to pay him a visit? Maybe put him on a take? No. You can't trust a hypocrite, Tom. We need to end his campaign aspirations, and in a way that keeps anyone from stepping up to the same platform. Vinny have a plan then? Of course. Turnbull's holding a rally near Central Island. The spot he picked is hard to reach and out in the open. Should have a beautiful view of the rally from the tower of the old prison. From there, you give Turnbull the third eye. Okay. I'll go see Vinny about the gun. But don't forget, you only got one shot. You miss, and this crew will usher him out of there quick. I'm the best shooter you got. Otherwise, you'd be talking to someone else. Then get it done. <laughs> Things are a little uneasy. I don't know. Hey, handsome. <laughs> but I care. You're wasted on that wife of yours. You know that? Uh, he'll never look our way. He's a good boy. Uh, sure. Why not? <laughs> All right, let's talk to Vinny. Where are Polly and Sam? I want to know what happens because he was telling the cop in the, uh, you know, in the whole intervention thing that we had going on in between chapters and stuff. Um, something about betrayal within the brothers. Hey, Wonder if that ever happens. Boss says you got something for me. Yeah, I got a shipment in from a guy at Fort Stanmore. Now, Salieri wants this to run like clockwork, so no heat to the guy's head bursts. I hit little Tony, stash one of these where you need it. So, up high in the old prison? Yeah. Family's got a lot of history in that place. Hoods who live there now. Ain't so classy. So watch yourself. Little Tony locked the rifle up tight in a room with a view. Up on the top floor. Sick of that politician shit in the papers, Tommy. We own this town now. Right between the eyes, huh? Find a way inside and make for the guard tower. The top deck is locked. That's what the key's for. Damn, I don't know we could go in here. What the hell? <laughs> what? Yo, that's dope. All right, good. Politicians come at us, we come back at them hard. That's how Lost Heaven's gonna learn. All right, I like it. 
Let's take a car. Let's see what we got here. It's a nice car. Swag! department store has been serving the people of Lost Heaven for wow. more than 65 years. We care for this city <laughs> and for each and every customer that comes through our door. We want the best for them and their families, and that's why this message is a little different. In recent years, our city has fallen prey to criminal elements, and only one man has shown that he has the strength and the moral fortitude required to once again allow the people to walk the streets without fear, with hope in their hearts. That man is Hank Turnbull. Mr. Turnbull stepped away going for from governor. political life after 20 years as congressman of the 27th district. The situation I'm starting to think, damn, if Frank would have gone anywhere, him to step into the breach he would have been just fine. And we could have no finer champion in the governor's mansion than Hank Turnbull. Okay, I just want to say this. I feel like Frank's gonna come around. I, I don't know. Like if you think about it, he might come back around. Whether for good or for worse, he might come back around. I don't know. We'll see. All right, here we are. Where are we headed? Find a way into the prison. What? Prison? What the heck? said you wanted the guard tower bade me to mark the way with this sign folks go through the sewer only way in then just keep heading up hey get out of there we ain't going nowhere what is this Turn around. follow the hobo sign yo what This is like uncharted territory. We've never been here. Who's this guy? <laughs> have you seen my rat? <laughs> <laughs> no, I have not seen your rat, dude. Someone's coming. No. Well, you ain't one of us. I'm more than you, mister. Please, dude, relax. I'm a gangster. You understand? Gangsters don't play games, silly boy. I'm here on a mission. I think this is the right place, right? Yo, is this the same prison that we went to? Um, the same prison that we were in in Mafia 2? Could this be the same prison? I don't know, is it? People just leave us be. Let me talk to this dude. This is our home. Why can't you people understand that? Is that you, cop? You're locked up tight, not getting in. Someone's coming through. This is very, very interesting. B wing, dude, that would be crazy. Imagine this is exactly the same prison the Vito went to. That would be insane. Let me see. I don't think it is. You know the guard tower. Up through the main cell block. Case locked most of the time. Beat the feds out. Thanks. 
Yo, this is creepy. <laughs> this is creepy. This is gonna be. Oh fuck! There's gonna be a shootout here. I know there is. All of the hobo sign. I I don't even know where the hobo sign is anymore. I kind of lost track of that. about this maybe that'll open that door exactly David? David, where are you? no it's not David ma'am it's it's Tommy okay it's Tommy not David Tommy say it with me Tommy <laughs> yo people are crazy here hey, who's <coughs> <bring trouble. coughs> Oh wait, that's not the person I'm supposed to kill. <gasps> it's upstairs. <laughs> it's upstairs. <laughs> Poor lady, I'm so sorry. Let me see if I find anything here. It's a crazy prison, bro. Hey, let me out of here. There. Now we'll be able to open up the cells. Let me open up this one as well. Can't. Okay. I guess they're already open. Now that I did that. Now, there's a guard up top. Alright. Where's that one note that I can pick up? I think it was a collectible or a letter. A letter. Hmm. I will wait for you. Of course. For God and for your daughter. She asks after you day after day, wanting you to come home. What do I tell her? That her father is a criminal and a killer, and that if he returns to our home swiftly, it will not come after patience or deserved suffering, but because of the company he keeps. If you don't die in there, when you come out, you must change. An end to the bloodshed. This family's curse, and the woman I know share my bed. If not, I will take her away. You will lose her forever. Sarah mourns you being locked inside that prison, but I have not wept once Dude, imagine that's like luigi's wife or something and it's sarah like sarah our our wife oh my god that'd be crazy this looks like an abandoned fucking prison that knows how old this shit is or don't that will beat you anyway hey who's this gonna put you in a ground oh shut your <laughs> trap you loser <laughs> come on but who in the ground, huh? You wanna die today, sucker? No, no, you did it. Oh yeah? Son of a what, bitch? Alright, let's open up the prison cells here. Where's that lever? Can, can we open it up? Yes, we can. This is very interesting, dude. This prison uh, mission is very, very different. Interesting indeed. Right, I'm gonna get that that letter that we got over there on the third cell, fourth cell. Okay, it's a collectible. I want to say we probably got to go here. Yeah. Get out. Whoa. Find the guard tower. Close to the guard tower. Real close. Elevator's out, but you can take the stairs. Hmm. The fuck is that? Okay, that's where I gotta go. 
Let me see what's down here. I didn't think so. Oh, there's nothing here. I like how you can come, kind of come here. You know, I guess that's if you took a different approach. Maybe there's multiple ways to get here. Reach the vantage point. Yo, what? Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. What he says. Wow. This man is fucking crazy. Oh my god. You gotta break out of this prison now. Escape the prison, right? Uh, oh, shit. come on. Escaping from well, prison. Hmm. Wait, is it this way? It is, but we can go that way. Take out my gun just in case. What? What way do we go? Oh, what the frick? Pick up a pipe. Oh, where's the pipe? How do you? Oh, okay. That's a creepy ass doll that we saw there, bro. It's fucking crazy. Stay out. Maybe through here. No, this is where we were at. Bro, I'm freaking lost. <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. Well, at least they're not going to spot us from here. I mean, actually, they might be coming because they said it came from the old prison. Oh, look at this. The electrical chair. That's crazy, dude. What is this? Lost Heaven Penitentiary. Joel Roberts, Simon Don, Richie Harold, Rufus Simon, Giovanni, Simon, Simon. I don't think there's anybody there that we know. Is there? I don't think so. The shot came from up here. Chief said he was declared dead at the scene. Oh, he did? Well, then you better know that's a job from us, bitch. We shoot to kill. No survivors. That's our motto. <laughs> Who needs guns when you got ninja skills like this? All right, we've got a... Uh... Oh, look who it is, Vinny. No, shh, shh, shh. Shut your trap. Shut your trap. Shut your trap. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pull out my uh, pipe. Because I feel like I'm not going to need the gun right now. 
as I'm actually doing a pretty good job at managing this very well. Let me get health. I don't even know I needed health until now. I think that's gonna open that gate up. Perfect. Detain everyone you see. The police! It's the police! Okay, so how the hell do we escape this prison? Bastards! Wow. Get to his side. Oh my god. Now nah, you did. <laughs> you know what we call that down here? Point blank, bitch. Take this health. My health is extremely low. Oh, we got a five star, a four star right now. Fuck! Every gap in the city is outside. Turn go with a good man. Hear that? Good man. Wait, how do I get out of here? Oh, it's through here. Sheesh, I'm an idiot. You guys are clever there, huh? Now I see why there was so much health and so much this and that. Now I see why. I couldn't before, but I do now. Fuck. Oh, there's health somewhere. Where's the health? In here. Oh, I can slide in through here. Let me take this. Alright, how do we get out of here, dude? Is it? No, that's not where we get out. I saw that white marker on the minimap. I was like, oh, maybe it's through there. Actually, no, we're in the process of losing them. I should probably get another car. Go back to patrols. We'll like this. Next time. What's he gonna do with the guns? Oh my god. Right here. It's her fucking car, are you kidding me? Out of all the people, she really got on the car. Cops need to hear about this. You think you're going? Yeah, I got trouble. Of a man with a firearm. Ooh. Wow. Really? Wait, why is this car? Why is this car not going anywhere? 
All right, so I'm gonna just go ahead and uh, take this guy's bike. You didn't see anything, you understand? You didn't see anything, you understand? <laughs> oh. oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Getting calls saying we lost sight of the guy. Officers in Oakwood, stay alert. So this is our new house. We just we just suddenly have it well, it's been a couple of years, but I didn't know that we had a new house. This is not the same house that that Vito, Vito and Joel visit in Mafia 2. Is it? It's not. Interesting. Did you hear about this Turnbull? Heard he was crooked as the day is long. It says in the paper he's going to be remembered for fighting to pass the 19th Amendment. Put his whole career on the line for it. Which one was that again? Woman suffrage, you idiot. He gave me the right to vote, Tom. Gave it to his wife and six daughters, too. Wow. Guess nobody's just one thing, are they? Guess not. I gotta go to work. <sighs> Tom. Don't do nothing you don't want to be remembered for, you hear me? Probably too late for that. <sighs> well. I honestly think that Sarah's the one that's keeping him in line. And even then, he's not <laughs> realistically in line. He's like, he's gotten worse over the years. Like, you can tell he just... Doesn't give a crap at this point, you know, but uh, yeah, the election campaign it was fun. That was a fun mission. We got to uh, break into a abandoned prison and then escape from the abandoned prison. So that was that was quite eventful. <sighs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop it a like. Catch you later.